Hello guys, so welcome to Care Tutorials. So let's continue the next part of this tutorial. So let's get started. So as you can see over here, we have started with the texturing part of this kitchen over here. So let's continue it. So now what we are going to do over here is like, we'll be texturing this uh, cabinet part over here. So let's just select this cabinet over here. So let's just select this cabinet part. So whatever the cabinet area is there, we'll be selecting that area over here. Select the area of the cabinet. Alright, so just select this much of the area over here. Let's again go into material and let's assign the same and give a UVW map. Set it as a box. Control I. So convert to editable poly. Select the polygons. Inverse it. So once you inverse this, so let's just exclude this all. Alright, so exclude this and isolate. Go into material and let's give this a marble texture over here. Give again a UVW map, set it as a box and convert to editable form. So once you have assigned this stuff, you can just save your file again. So the things which are left out somewhere can just select and assign so we'll be assigning some metal over here for this so let's select this let's go into material so texture is going to take time because there are many objects for the metal part let's give a bit of a color over here and let's go into this Fresnel Reflections give a reflect property over here and 
just assign that for the metal so we'll be assigning the same so wherever it is required for the metal part we'll be assigning this over here So just select this and let's just assign it and name it as a metal over here. So once you assign this, you can save your file again. Now we'll be selecting this part. Before that, let's go with this. So let's go into this. Select the polygons. Go into material. Take a V-ray material. And let's add a wooden texture over here. In the kitchen texture. Assign the texture over here can go with the cylindrical part also so select this polygons material UVW map after that polygons select this polygons go into material Again take a V-Ray material and we'll be definitely assigning this black metal texture over here. Also we'll give a bit of reflectiveness to it. So UVW map or you can use a cylinder also. So select this all and let's just assign the same over here so select this so convert to editable poly polygons and let's assign the same over here and let's give a UVW map make it as a cylinder convert to poly go into material assign it save your file again so now we'll be assigning some texture on this also so select this polygons for the sink part so select this hole over here go into material again take a V-ray material let's just give a color to it give a bit of reflection and just assign this same and the same shader will go with this also so let's just assign the same
So save your file. Select this part. Let's go into material. Let's take a VRAM material and let's just pick a color to it. Give a bit of reflection. So slightly you can give such stuff to it looks much better So assign the same over here, select this and this, assign the same property over here. So wherever you feel it's required you can easily assign it in that way. So just go on saving your file over here again. So guys if you have any doubts please write it in the comment section over here so please like and subscribe my channel so we'll continue the rest of the part in the next tutorial so thanks for watching this tutorial